Hello guys, I just wanted to show you a cool sup cart that I made. It's a do-it-yourself sup cart, stand-up paddleboard cart. And I'm gonna flip this camera around and show you how I made it, okay? So here it is. This is a couple wheels, one inch PVC pipe with some insulation foam around it, a couple joins, and a bungee strap, bungee cord. And um, just wanted to explain that I got these wheels from Lowe's for $14.95 each and they are a half inch diameter for the axle. It's a half inch threaded rod with a locking nut right here and a washer and um, you have a couple elbow joins there and there's a cap down in through there right here where I um, drilled a hole, half inch hole to put the threaded axle through. And there's just a hex nut there and a locking washer all half inch. But um, it's pretty easy, just needed some glue and uh, had these pieces cut. So piece right here is like a, uh, I think five inches. I was thinking probably it should have it a little less than that, probably four or three inches even. And these uh, bars across here about 20, 22 inches long I think this is a T section and um, yeah it's pretty easy you just uh, you know glue it in there make sure it's secure and it's uh, that fast cement glue and then you got to drill that cap in there glue it in through this join right here put that locking washer on here hex nut here um, I didn't even have to cut the rod it came in a three uh, foot uh, length so this is actually three foot threaded rod. That's the length of this uh, sup cart. And so here it is, the sup cart here. I'm gonna show you how it rolls in a minute. All right, so I have my hand on the grip here, holding it on, and I'm just pulling it along. It's rolling pretty easy. I got these um, higher or larger diameter wheels, so it would roll a little better. The balloon wheels or the beach wheels are pretty expensive, and so these were just from Lowe's that I uh, picked up for 15 bucks each. So, there you can roll. I'm gonna give it another view here. I'm gonna set the uh, tripod up, and then you can see how it rolls when I'm carrying it. I just wanted to show you I loaded a bunch of my stuff up on there backpack wetsuit the paddle could have uh, put it underneath the uh, strap there but I'm not going that far but I wanted to also mention that these wheels are rated I think 50 pounds each um, so you know you don't want to put too many boards on here but I specifically made it like this so you could stack at least two boards this board's probably about 20 pounds 18 I don't know, 18, 15, somewhere. I don't know the exact weight, but two boards would be fine. You can just stack them on top of each other and then use a bungee cord or strap, aka strap, um, to put them together. Anyway, I'll show you how it goes with the uh, stuff on there. All right, so here it is, rolling the stuff. Rolling the bag, the wheels, rolling over the grass pretty good. Stuff's not falling off yet. I think it might fall. Wetsuit's gonna fall off the back. Kinda getting more bumpy, but it's doing pretty good. So, um, all up, I think this was 50 bucks. So you can buy other uh, sup carts, stand-up carts, for about that same price, maybe cheaper, but I wanted it flat like this so I could stack and put stuff other, other stuff on top. But good clearance, these are 14, and a half or 14 inch wheels from Lowe's 
again, threaded rod. I didn't even have to cut anything but the PVC. So it's pretty, pretty cool. Hey guys, so if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, um, comment, follow, subscribe. Pretty easy to make. Um, just uh, thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day.